Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we're going to take a look at the card game, Justice League Shuffle. It says four and one card games. So I got it pretty cheap off Amazon. It's uh, Justice League, which I like. So let's check it out. All right, here we have the card game. Let's see, Superman, Batman, Wonder Woman. It's called Shuffle. who makes it was by Carter Mundy oh man box is pretty flimsy unfortunately okay Got the cars here Four and one. Got some online video game guides. So hopefully it has some written rules as well. That's that would be a pain. Okay. Cards here. Superman, a couple of different poses, which is cool. Aquaman, very upset looking Wonder Woman. A little more traditional. Not a huge fan of the silver, it looks okay. Green Lantern, Cyborg, and Batman, Flash. And then you have everyone on this card except for uh, Wonder Woman, who is not on this card. And not on that card. Hmm, that's odd. Not on that card. Huh. Okay, there's the back. Pretty nice looking art. Easy to see, easy to read. This is always a plus. And instructions. Oh man, what's going on here? <laughs> what? Go to shuffle.cards for our video game guide. Um, I'm not very happy about that. Hmm. Let's see a snap game, which is probably just slapjack. That's really, that's really dumb. That is really, really dumb. I don't like that at all. I guess you can play quick pairs, a matching game. They're kind of reaching on their four and one games here. Quick action. Okay, here's your quick action. That means absolutely nothing. And I don't want to show the video on my video because there's probably some legality issues with that, which is very dumb. But it says, there you go. <laughs> Shuffle dot cards for our video game guides. I mean, why waste the time to make this? You know, I, just, I don't understand why waste the time to make this and not go ahead and put the text with it. Is it that important that you go to their website? I mean, that's very, and what if this website gets defunct in the future or maybe it has already, I don't know, what year is this? Um, I'm sure it doesn't say on this informative uh, thing here. I don't know. It doesn't look that old, but still. Well, let me um, let me see if the website is there. 
before we go any further, Dean guys. English. Oh, um, it gets worse. So, we go to the website, and then as of course this similar, and then you can download the PDF. <laughs> so, <sighs> PDFs. You have an action game, Crazy Eights, Dominoes, Happy Family. I don't know what's going on here. This is ridiculous. Quick pairs. So I guess depending on maybe what shuffle box you got depends on I mean you can play rummy it looks like and the snap of course let them so maybe the only different game will be action I'm gonna look at a PDF that's very disappointing action game so in your action game with your superheroes here let's give you something to look at object of this game is to get rid of all your cards as soon as possible. First shuffle the cards and deal five cards to each player. Put the remaining cards in the pile face down. Turn the top card over and place it next to the pile. This card will be the first card of the face up pile. Any player can start the game. The player whose turn it is will play a card with the same color, blue blue, uh, or symbol as the face up card. When a card with a symbol is played, the action related to that symbol must be performed. Then the next play continues. When no cards can be played, the player must take top, you know, must draw from the deck. If that card matches, it can be played right away. If not, the turn moves on. Okay, so it says if you play, uh, what? <laughs> so as an example of going in, a1 and H4. Alright, so there's a wild card. So if you play that, you go to your action card, uh, legend here or whatever, and then you get an additional turn. Um, yeah. Okay. Then, if you play these cards, B2 and G3, this is really dumb. Um, so you go to B2, Aquaman, G3, a Flash, a green and green. <laughs> you play B2 and G3, the next player has to draw an additional card. So this is a draw two in some odd way. So I don't know how you play. You play them at the same time to like get rid of your hand faster. It just says players who turn it is must play a card with the same color or number. Uh, I can do clockwise, throw one, one, one person have one card left. The player needs to set, shout shuffle in order to be the winner of the game. He forgets he must draw two cards. He or she may draw, must draw two cards. So I guess you play these at once. Because they're action cards. <laughs> this is really dumb. Okay, so Aquaman and Flash do that. If you play C3 and F2, we're gonna go C3 and F2. One woman and bat. You can exchange all of your cards with a player of your choice. Okay, I mean, that's okay, I guess. But, I mean, I guess you have a lot of cards in your hand if you're dropping two and still exchanging. Um, yeah. Yep, yep. And the last action you can do is... D4 and E1, so D4, so Green Lantern gets in the mix here, and E1, it's reverse, the uh, game changes directions, uh, yeah. 
So you could get this card game, or you could just get a Marvel Super or Superhero Uno card game. So that is the one. This is the game guy for the action game. Yeah, the action game. Okay, so other games are labeled as regular games, uh, Crazy A's, Happy Families. So there's a Happy Families game. Little, kind of want to see what it says for this. We got a symbol on the top of the cards. This game has eight families, A through H. Each family has four cards. Obviously, the game is to collect as many families as possible. Uh, when playing with more than two players, deal out all the cards equally amongst the players. The first player starts by asking another player for a card needed to complete the family. <laughs> uh, let's just go fish. Card is handed over. Player doesn't have a certain card. The turn ends. Next player goes for the rest of the card. The player re can retake cards taken in previous rounds. Retake what? what? Anyways. So, if you ask for a family member from another player, if they don't have it, you go fish. As soon as a player gathers a complete family, all four cards are put face down on the table. The player collects the most family, leaves, wins. Imagine that. So if you re rename Go Fish Happy Families to the pairs, you know, <coughs> excuse me, you get all four cards. So I don't know, I guess I'm saying like this is garbage in a way, but it's, I don't know. You can get some enjoyment out of it. It's just handy to, to like add superheroes to your classic card games, I guess. And then there's old maid, so you know what that is, and pairs, which is probably just I'm gonna go fish in a rummy game, and yeah. But I really thought it was gonna have its own unique game, being called like Shuffle, because we make a Star Wars and I think a Transformer card game that actually has a little more unique mechanics based off kind of like war, but more to it instead of just rehashing existing card games. The art's nice. The cards are pretty good stock. Eh, they're okay. Top loading box always kind of sucks to me, but there you have Justice League Shuffle.